This is the 2005 Mercedes-Benz SLR. This is the greatest Anglo-German cooperation since, um, ever. It's the Mercedes-Benz SLR McLaren. From Germany, the big badge on the front, and the 5.4-litre supercharged V8 that gives this car 626 horsepower and a top speed of 208 miles an hour. From England comes the grey and silver, borrows in the top pocket, engineering know-how of the McLaren F1 team who came up with the carbon fiber body and built the whole thing in their Surrey factory. As you might imagine, the marriage between these two companies from these two nations was not easy. Mercedes insisted the SLR had to be front-engined and look exactly like this. McLaren insisted this was not ideal for a supercar. Mercedes wanted a comfortable, well-equipped cruiser. McLaren wanted a hardcore, lightweight racer. The two sides couldn't even agree on what the SLR sounded like at full chat. Mercedes said it was like a Messerschmitt. The British reckoned it was more like a Spitfire. Yet despite the disagreements, the end result was a very fine car. Monstrously fast and loud when you drove like you'd sat on a bee, yet relaxed and easy to live with when you didn't. The only real problem were the carbon brakes, which worked like a switch. But whatever, the SLR is dead now and the two firms behind it have gone their separate ways. Although strangely, Mercedes now make the SLS, a hardcore cruiser, and McLaren, the MP4-12C, a civilized supercar, which is somehow slightly ironic 